What you're going to need to mount the gauge is a drill with a Phillips head bit and we're going to need a small hand level to make sure that the top of the gauge is level and it's not slanted in any way. And when we set it up, we want to set it up in a way that the gauge at the top of it is going to be four to six inches from the top of the post so that no rain is going to fall and uh, splatter on this surface here and uh, bounce into the gauge. So when we do that, we take the brace off. I've got my three screws that come with the gauge and then I'll just kind of find a spot that's kind of high up on this post to make sure that it's high enough to prevent splashing. So I'll set my gauge in here and then I'll take my level and I'll check it a couple of different ways to make sure that it's level. So I check it this way and I check it this way. In your case, when you're setting up a new gauge, um, you know, sometimes it helps to hold it on there first and check it two ways. And if it's leaning one way or the other, you can always use a shim and you just slide it in between the post and the brace. You can use pieces of cardboard or whatever works just to get it leaning uh, in the right way for it to be level both ways.